Is This a Great State or What? is sponsored by We Oki. We got you, Oklahoma. Well, Oklahomans, perhaps you, celebrated Earth Day Saturday with organized cleanups and recycling drives. But Galen Culver spent the afternoon looking a little deeper at pictures of our wild planet. He sat down with an artist who draws Bigfoot from eyewitness accounts. Down by the creek at the river crossing. Of all the people taking advantage of a lovely Earth Day afternoon at Adair Park in the town of Stillwell, Oklahoma. So I was able to see both of them. These two men might not garner a second look. Uh, which foot was facing you? Unless you got close was, enough to eavesdrop on their conversation. One, and then the front one was right here. Specifically, D.W. Lee's description of what he saw a few years ago. My headlight went and caught two Bigfoot carrying a, about a 300 pound calf. Lee has told his story of encountering two, maybe three, large hairy creatures before, but never in this context, never as someone like Jim Whitehead listened and brought the traumatic experience to life. Yeah. Longer hair on the head, I mean, you kind of mentioned that. Yeah, kind of makes me shiver a little bit from the whole encounter, you know. Whitehead has a history of his own Sasquatch sightings to draw from. He started sitting down with people who had encounters of their own several years ago. A lot of them like to actually have me do this if just for their own sake, you know, so they can have something to say, this is what I saw. At symposiums, at festivals, and hunts for these creatures, he slowly collected a unique archive of eyewitness accounts drawn with pencil a forensic record of what a certain number of people out there insist they've seen. So that's pretty close to what you saw. Yeah. This is the picture D.W. Lee remembers from that night. Two large creatures carrying a calf, walking away into the darkness. It does take me back to the night that that happened. It's not proof. No one Jim Whitehead has interviewed is arguing that. But there is some solace in it. A kind of picture of something strange they remember happening when no one else was there. In Stillwell, Galen Culver, News 4. Is this a great state or what? And Jim Whitehead says he's had sessions with at least 80 different people who've had experiences just like Mr. Lee's.